is popping. It's popping. It's popping. This is Moni with True Beauty Glams. Um, like I told you, I was gonna make the lip gloss base and you can always turn it into a matte lip gloss or if you put um, what is uh, this stuff called polyisoprutein, that is like a really thick gel. You can make your lip gloss with that. Um, like I said, shout out to Victoria Lowe. She taught me all this stuff. So my, um, recipe is a little, one little bit different because I don't have avocado avocado oil. She had avocado oil. I'm instead going to use jojoba oil. So I'm going to show y'all exactly what I'm going to use. As you see, I have the double, the double broiler with the water and I'm just using um, a steel pan because it's easier to clean. You can always use a glass one. This is the wax candy, candelilia, like a candy wax. And I got, um, I think I got this from in the Carnuba. I got this wax from makeyourown.buzz. And I'll put the information in the link. And it says, um, so I'm gonna take one teaspoon of it, I'm gonna show you everything. The castor oil, um, the grapeseed oil, coconut oil liquid and this is the coconut oil that I got pretty much the 100% coconut oil but I have coconut oil the hard kind too but this kind is already liquefied um a little bit of vegetable glycerin I may put a tad of that in there because I know you put that in there when you do your hair and stuff jojoba oil the sweet almond oil and the preservative cap and I got this from um TK be tr uh, trading. I had to just go out to Dollar Tree and get me some measurements because it was like one teaspoon, half a teaspoon. And I got these vitamin E capsules. I'm gonna open them up and gonna put a couple of squirts of vitamin E. So this is what I'm about to do. So let me measure this stuff out. And boom. so it says, so you do equal parts. I'm gonna do one teaspoon of the canoe ca carnauba wax. And I have like all of this stuff. I got dimethicon. That's to help with like your lip gloss part. Okay, so it says one teaspoon. So I'm gonna take my one teaspoon and you can shop on True Beauty glams.com and also download the app on the iphone or the uh, android so it says take one teaspoon of that because i'm making my own uh lip, lip gloss base and this is going to be what i'm going to use to continue all the time to do my lip glosses i have the versa gel which i probably gonna use the rest of that um just for like my tinted lip glosses but I'm gonna be using this base like um, she had. And then these are like the flakes. So I'm just putting it in there and it's melting as we speak. <laughs> it's melting. So one teaspoon, one teaspoon of that. Nan says one tablespoon of castor oil. Okay, so I'm gonna put one tablespoon of your castor and I, I just um, did a video go check out my first video where I showed how to um, make your liquid pigments okay so I just did that so it said one tablespoon of castor oil no two tablespoons so I'm gonna put one more tablespoon of the castor oil Okay, I'm gonna turn it down a little bit because it's really boiling. So two tablespoons of castor oil, and then it says two tablespoons of sweet almond oil. I haven't gotten a big a big thing of sweet almond oil. I got this from TKB Trading, but it's just enough for me to make my base. 
Okay. And then it says avocado, but I'm gonna switch that to jojoba. I like jojoba oil better. I don't have no avocado, so we're gonna use the jojoba. It gives it, you know, the good moisture that it needs. Okay, so it says two tablespoons of that, two tablespoons of coconut oil. It looks like two tablespoons of all the oils. So we just go in. Okay, so I'm making a lip, a lip gloss base that you pretty much, you scoop out and then you can add your liquid pigments. It makes it really easy when you're doing um when you're doing everything and i'm gonna put just a little bit of grapeseed oil because that wasn't on the recipe but i'm gonna put a little bit because this is my this is my recipe so i can do whatever i want to do a couple of drops of vegetable glycerin I know in um, the natural hair community, we use that. And then it says, um, I'm not gonna put the acidotocane in it because I'm gonna use this as just a base period. And when I need to make the mat, I just put the droplets of the mat into the mixture that I'm doing. And so it says uh, two to three drops of preservative Okay, so I just put some drops of the preservative cap. I don't know if y'all can see that. Okay. Let me turn my other light on so y'all can see better. Okay. And then it says the vitamin E. So I'm getting ready to open up these gel caplets. Matter of fact, I'm just gonna cut it <laughs> and get that the droplets of the vitamin E out. Okay, so this is liquefying down. I'm gonna start stirring it in a minute. Get those droplets of vitamin E. Now, I said I was gonna do three caplets of the vitamin E. And this is pure vitamin E, as you see, it's coming right out the caplets. And if you have a Dollar Tree, you may wanna go to the Dollar Tree. Okay. I guess I put my gloves on now. I've been making all those colors, so. And then I'm gonna use my, my spatula to just mix it around. and just get this uh, wax to melt. Let's see if y'all can see. I'm just trying to work this, get this wax to melt. So I'm gonna take it out. It's the perfect amount for my for my base. And now I'm gonna put the lid on it. And I'm gonna put it in the freezer for about 15 minutes. 
and that's how you make your that's how you make your lip gloss base. That's it. <laughs> so I have like so many more. It's like look how much you get, and it wasn't even really that expensive. And so I'll be making lots of lip glosses. Um, you know, from now on, lip gloss, matte lip gloss, and um. If you go to make your own buzz, I got this big thing of castor oil for like $8. Our first lip gloss with the base using by Victoria Lowe. Okay. Thanks for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Also check out episode three showing how I make my lip gloss um, with using the base. Subscribe, comment, share, and I love y'all for watching. Smooches, always remember, keep God first and be blessed. It's popping. It's popping. It's popping.